Hello. Um, so today was supposed to be a different day for myself. I should have been in the hospital right now preparing for surgery this afternoon, but instead I'm at home juggling my emotions. Um, I should have had surgery today for um, an ovarian cyst. Instead, I am at home and my surgery has been postponed because of another emergency health situation that has to heal before I can proceed with the surgery. My husband and I have been dealing with IVF now for the past year and a half. Um, still no baby. We have been struggling just with different obstacles that we weren't aware of and different health situations that have to um, be healed before we can kind of continue the IVF in, in order for our bodies to be the, the healthiest that, that they can be going forward. Um, it's, it's a somber day for myself, as I said, just when we think we're able to, um, just when it seems like stuff is with, within reach for us, um, there's another obstacle that we weren't even expecting. Um, within this past year and a half, um, we've only done a couple days worth of shots and a couple days worth of meds, and as I said, just, just different obstacles that we didn't think that would even be part of our journey. Um, I, as I said, I'm struggling with my emotions. I'm having a tough time being positive um, and hopeful that something will, will come eventually for us with the IVF process and with a baby, hopefully in our future. Um, as I said, it's it's a really somber day for myself just because I, like, it, it, it seemed like stuff with, was, in re, was in reach for us. Um, no, <laughs> um, it seems like stuff was in reach for us and it, again, to now wait like three more months on top of the year and a half. It's just been been rough. Um, to all those that... <laughs> it's really tough to um, see people with babies and expecting and um, cute announcements and all that. Um, it's a weird jealousy feeling that I never thought I would expect or never thought I would have to deal with. Um, it's awesome and it, it's nothing against them and I'm so happy for them and so happy for their baby and their family and it's just, I want that and like it doesn't seem like it's easy. <laughs> um, It just seemed like stuff was so close. <laughs> and yes, we were just beginning the process, but it, like it felt so real and it felt so close. <laughs> and now just to like be stumbled back down the ladder again. And it's, it's tough. <sighs> Quick composure moment. <laughs> um, as I said, it, it, it's been a tough road. Um, and I didn't think this would be part of our journey. I thought we would get married and instantly have babies. And um, I'm, I'm having a tough time, like, <laughs> coming to terms that this is our journey and this is our story. And we just have to wait until it's the best time. And um, it's frustrating when I think it's the best time and it's not. Um, and it's, it's tough to be positive and it's tough to know that there's a, a timeline that I'm not aware of. And... Um, it's tough to want to do stuff, <laughs> um, to remain positive and, um, these past couple weeks I've been, um, emotionally eating and that's not been helpful and that's just a bad cycle <laughs> to be in. So it's just, it's tough to stay positive and it's tough to, um, it's just tough to stay positive. <laughs> Um, so I guess the reason I'm sharing this is because I, I want, I guess I want to show people that it's, it's okay to be vulnerable <laughs> and it's okay to cry and it's okay to, um, need some help. And, um, again, I'm, I'm trying to be positive and I'm, I'm, I know it's out of my control, um, but it's, I guess it's okay to, um, 
it's okay that stuff doesn't go as planned. Um, yeah. So <laughs> I'm trying to stay positive. I'm trying to um, stay busy and keep my mind off of things and be happy for them. Right. As I wrap up, um, I just want to say thank you for listening and thank you for listening to me cry and listen to me blabble on. Um, I think it's helpful sometimes just to um, get it all out there and just know that we could use some positive thoughts our way and um, yeah so again I'm trying to stay positive um, I I need some positive positivity coming our way so if you don't mind um, sending some some thoughts our way and some prayers our way we would really really appreciate that I know we have uh, a long journey ahead of us and from what we've experienced so far a bumpy journey ahead of us so again thank you for listening and um thank you for watching me cry all right